Hey, welcome back to my channel. So this week I thought I would film um, a very requested week of workouts. I did this video before, but I think I must have filmed it nearly a year ago now, maybe like eight months, nine months ago, probably like back in March of last year. But nevertheless, obviously my routine has changed a bit since then. So I'm gonna show you how I've changed my routine and what a week's worth of workouts look like for me. So at the moment I'm actually working on like a two week rotor, so just to give a bit of backstory. I, this video is only going to be a week long, but maybe if you want to see the second week of the kind of routine that I do, then please let me know and I can do it again. Um, but basically I do one week, I only do four sessions, and then if I'm feeling up for it, I'll do like a cardio session as well, so five sessions. And then the second week I do five sessions. So normally, pretty much, the first week will be legs, push, rest, legs, pull, and then rest. And then if I want to, on the extra day, I can do, I sometimes maybe go on a run or something, depending if the weather's nice and what I'm feeling. I might do a run, do some sprints or something like that. Um, and I'll show you kind of how I split up the workouts throughout the week. But with the upper body session, I normally put like a bit of abs or something at the end of it, but I'll show you that throughout the week. So today is obviously a leg day and you're gonna see everything I do. I don't split my leg workers up workouts up now like I used to I used to split them up so it'd be glutes and hamstrings and then glutes and quads but I'm just doing like full leg sessions and I kind of have it's more I split my leg day up by like one day is a deadlift day and one day is a hip thrust day so I don't feel like I'm doing the same exercise every leg day it kind of makes it a bit more exciting I think because otherwise I used to do like hip thrust basically every leg workout and after a while I just hated them I just despised them so this is why I split it up and it just makes me really motivated to like hit those PBs and try and lift heavier. But yeah, the second week of workouts, if you don't want to listen to me ramble about it and just skip to the workouts then skip forward. But second week of workout, I do the same, but on the fifth day I do a full body strength workout, which basically just weights, but a hot full body, which is nice. It's a nice way to end the week, but that would normally be on like the Friday, yeah, so it'd be legs, push, rest, legs, pull, and then on the Saturday, full body, and then rest on the Sunday, because I do like to rest on a Sunday, which is bizarre, because you have more time to go to the gym on Sunday, but just, you can reset, do you know what I mean? But yeah, so I hope you enjoy this video, I will explain the workouts as I go through, um, I've actually already recorded today's workout, so it's Monday, and I've already recorded the leg workout, I was in a bit of a rush this morning, and I looked like absolute crap, and I was like, I'll just go film the workout, and then when I come back, and the light's better, because it was kind of dark, I'll film the intro, so here I am. But yeah, today's leg workout was really good. Um, the only thing that I'm not gonna show, just to make sure it's like not too long, is I haven't shown like my warm up, I've shown my like, activation, um, and a bit of my warm up actually in today's um, workout, but I normally stretch after and stretch before, um, and this is all pretty repetitive. Um, considering on the day so and a lot of it is on my instagram so if you want to see my warm-ups and stretches i do before a workout then just head over to my instagram and take a look on that because i thought i don't want to put it in every workout if that makes sense because otherwise this video is gonna be very long i hope you enjoy it Nevertheless, I'm up, I'm about to go do it's push day today, which is probably my least favourite day. I just find it a bit boring and today's workout's quite repetitive, but then nevertheless, we're getting it done. I'm wearing Gymshark, oh you can't really see in this light, Gymshark Adapt Animal Seamless Collection with the kind of crossover bra. You'll see it in the gym. 
but yeah let's get going i will show you the workout um it's about eight o'clock i'm waiting i'm keep checking refreshing the gym to wait for it to get emptier but yeah we're heading off now because i'm on a tight schedule so i think i'll literally just be doing the push workout today no abs or anything afterwards or like any cardio warm up because we don't have time we're just going in and getting it done <laughs> Tuesday so I would have spoken to you this morning before my upper body workout but I thought I would check in because I am um, I thought I would check in because I have a rest day tomorrow so Wednesday is going to, is my rest day sometimes this is the day I do a run on if not sorry really weird sound that if not it will be the Sunday or Friday I can't remember I'll figure this out um but yeah so it's it's an op optional rest day because if i want to do a cardio day i would do it on a wednesday but i might do it on a different day this week um but yes wednesday is pretty much always a rest day for me and thank god i think i need it so today i went to an event with bow and t um in celebration of the launch of megan grubb's new collection with them for her beyond app so that's really cool um and it was really good fun and we did a little hip workout like lower body hip workout and i actually feel knackered this afternoon so i think it'll be really nice to have a rest day tomorrow and just catch up on some work and stuff so yeah that is kind of the plan but i thought i would just tune in now because i probably won't pick up the camera tomorrow and have to do like a full day of eating we'll see but yeah for this video i'm just saying tomorrow will be a rest day and i will see you on thursday which is lex and i will fill you in but yeah this is a reminder you need to take rest days normally i take three on the first week of my program i take three rest days and then on the second week is two so yeah that's my breakdown but like i said if i don't want the extra third rest day i might do a run or something like that because i like running and i like to fit it into my program somehow but yeah do a i would check in and i hope you guys enjoying this video still hey i just realized i hadn't checked in after following my workout this morning because i kind of got up literally looked a wreck and just went straight to the gym so i thought it would be easy i was like i'll come back have a shower and wash my hair and then explain today's workout um i do apologize for the clips that you were about to see from my leg workout today because some of them i think some interesting angles it's just it's really hard when people are in the gym i really don't want to i'm not i'm not scared about getting my camera anymore i don't really care i just get it out but i do always feel guilty i don't want people to be in the background because i know people go to the gym and the last thing they probably want is to be filmed or in the background or something and um, they just want to get on with what they want to do there so i don't want to yeah i don't want to kind of make anyone feel uncomfortable like that so that's why some of the angles are a bit weird because i'm not trying to go from angles where I'm not going to get people in the background etc or like in their gym space so I do apologize but yeah so today was a leg workout I really struggled today because I just really struggled to do my hip thrusting so today's leg workout was like hip thrust focused I have three sets of hip thrust in there um and to try and like reach my pb and I started with 100 and which is normally quite comfortable for me and I don't normally talk about weights like PBs and stuff, but I started with 100 and I just, it was not sitting. You know, it just doesn't sit on your hips right. And the box is there. They have a 12 inch one and then they have an 18 inch, I think it's inches, 18 inch one. And 18 is too high and the 12 is too low. Like I need a 16. It's just not the right height. And I saw someone on TikTok the other day do one at the end of the bench. So they like angled it down. So I think I'm going to try that next. Um, 
because yeah today I was just really uncomfortable which didn't feel right um so I don't really know what was going on because I went fine but yeah I don't know if it was just like bruise my hips or something and I just I just wasn't enjoying it basically so yeah that is that but other than that it was a really good workout pretty like short and sweet um I filmed a bit of my warm-up for you guys and then tomorrow is meant to be a rest day but because I want to work out five times this week I think I'll do my pool day tomorrow and then do a run on Saturdays so it's Friday tomorrow so I'll do my pool day tomorrow and then do a run on Saturday and then rest Sunday and that'll be my week's worth of workouts um so this video will go live on Sundays it's already for the week in advance but yeah I felt like that I had more to say but I think that's it so I hope you enjoy this workout <laughs> Friday. Sorry, this is going to be quite a long video, but I actually started putting some of this footage into like Premiere Pro this morning, and I don't think it's going to be too long because the actual workouts obviously I've just like filmed the first set and then not filmed like the whole thing. Otherwise, that would be ridiculously long. Like my workout's like 45 minutes to an hour sometimes. So <laughs> yeah, um, but today was pool day, so kind of like back and biceps focus. Um, it was really good and I think uh, looking through the clips and stuff none of the angles are completely appalling and um, the gym was pretty empty today so I was like putting my camera like, on top of things because I just feel bad if there's I don't want to sometimes I just balance my camera on like another piece of equipment like opposite what I'm using but if it's busy I'm like someone's going to come along and my camera's going to be on there and that's that's awkward um, but yeah, nevertheless, it was a really good workout and I actually tried to do some abs at the end I did about 5 minutes but my camera cut out so there's no I'll show you like the 10 second clip <laughs> at the beginning of what it was, but yeah. So yeah, you're about to see my workout for the day. I am gonna do, so it's now Friday, I am gonna do five days this week and I'm going to run tomorrow, which can be very interesting. But I don't think I'll get any clips of that because I'm not gonna take you with me running. But yeah, that is basically what I'll be doing. So let me put my Cool workout now. with a run well I'm going to and then I will rest on Sunday um so yeah thank you for watching this video if you want to see the second week of my plan as I obviously mentioned at the beginning of the video that I break up my workout sorry about the mess in the background I break up my workout by like a two-week schedule and I do four sessions on the first week and five on the next but I actually do realistically I do five on each week I don't know what I'm saying that. So I do five in each week. The first week, the fifth session is a cardio session. And the second week, the fifth session is a full body strength session. So that is basically how I split it up. Like I've explained throughout this video. But yeah, if you want me to do another, the second week, then I'm happy to do that. Like it wouldn't be next week, but it'd be the following week because yeah, I need to make, I'll have to break it up a bit. Or unless I could do it next week to be fair. So go straight into it. But yeah, let me know because I'm happy to do that. Um, but I don't think know if it's really necessary because all you're really going to gain is you're just going to see the full body strength session I do. And I can film that and put it on Instagram if necessary. 
But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful if you're like new to the gym and you're wondering how to structure your workouts. But I literally can't stress enough. Do not copy exactly what I do and expect that we'll get the same progress or anything like that because everyone's different. Different things work for different people. I had to do a lot of trial and error before I found the routine that worked for me. I used to do a ridiculous amount of HIIT training and cardio and yeah, I found this really works for me. And everyone is different. Like some people really thrive off doing HIIT workouts all the time. But I do like a mixture between the two. So like if anything, I would happily have more like HIIT workouts in my routine currently. But this just really works and fits around my routine at the moment, doing the weight training and how I split it up now. And then the occasional cardio session. So yeah, that is what my week's worth of workouts looks like. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, just give it a thumbs up. Um, and subscribe because it really supports me.